My research is basically on neuroscience in understanding different principles of how the brain works. I mean, how neurons in the brain can make us see something or, or remember something. So, for example, we did some, some experiments just trying to quantify how people look at arts in the museum and, and in the laboratory. And looking at exactly the same art pieces, we saw that the pattern of gazing of, of these art pieces was completely yeah, different. It's just like you at the painting and visually explore it for me. If you, if you zoom into a computer screen, you just see pixels. And if you go very close to a painting in the art gallery, you will see some texture. You will see a pattern that the artist really wanted to, to give to the painting. So if you see the original in the art gallery, I mean, you can get as close as you want and you will always find interesting information. So we found that, I mean, looking at something in the museum in the right environment or in an art gallery, makes a huge difference than looking at something in, in a computer screen. Well, I thought from the very beginning that it would be great to have a visual artist involved in, in this type of, of interaction between science and, and arts. And I was very lucky to, to, to find an artist from Argentina, Mariano Molina, very talented painter that, that was willing to, to get involved into this project. The result is, is what you see here in this exhibition, is, is somehow combining the, the arts point of view with the neuroscience point of view. It is nice in, in two different ways. First, I mean, it's very helpful for me because it helps me to bring to the public some very basic principles of how we see. And, and second, I think it's interesting because some of them, they are not known to, to artists. So Mariano had the chance to get knowledge from visual perception, I mean, and neuroscience, to create things that are somehow novel and I think the result is quite interesting.